Okay, here's part C on number three on the energy primer. It's a great question. It talks about how, what if you decided to buy a new 80% efficient uh, furnace and it was going to cost you $4,000 to do that. Would it be worth it? How long would it take you to, to, to save enough money to pay back the cost of this? So if we go back to the original problem, the original problem showed that uh, we needed 1,941 CCF to supply the heat because the furnace was only 60% efficient and that's how much it was costing us. Well, if our furnace is now 80% efficient, then we only need 1,456 CCF. And if we know the cost, 1 CCF costs 90 cents, so it's going to cost us $1,310.40 each winter to run this new, more efficient furnace, which is about a 400 and some dollar savings over the old furnace. The old furnace was costing us 1700 and some. So if you look at these, at these differences, if, if it was costing us that, but now it's going to cost us this, then that's how much money we're going to save each winter. But we had to shell out $4,000 for the furnace in the first place. So if we had to pay that for the furnace, how many years is it going to take us to earn this money back? Doing this division comes out to a little over nine years. So if you're going to stay in the house much longer than nine years, then it would make sense especially if the furnace is, is old and broken anyway, it would make sense to switch to a new furnace. You'd make your money back. So in the 10th year, that $436 would be saved. And you can only assume that gas prices would go up. So you might actually save even more.